not really sure how to say it, but I looked really hard and tried to see something. And with your Sharingan and your words, I felt like I could see it. See what? Naruto? Why do you trust him so much? Because I'm positive that he won't fail any worse than you did. Why? Because when he falls down, I'll help him. Why would you help him? Because he doesn't give up on the world or on his dreams. That's just the kind of guy he is. And that way of living draws others to him. When it seems like he's going to fall, we naturally want to help him. Could something like that actually exist in this hell? You would have been able to see it if you really tried to. We have the same eyes, after all. It may be that once you gather friends who you can trust, hope becomes something you can actually see. At least, that's what I think. Obito. You can't be so stubborn all the time. Let's go. Maybe. I feel. Bring it on already, you idiot! The same way. Stay out of the way, Madara. But at this point, there is something I must do. What? I need to take a little more of you. Yeah. Dead man! Stop. 
I should have known you wouldn't go down this easily, Madara. <sighs> now it truly feels like a battle with you. And since we have both been reanimated, we can enjoy this semi-permanently. I know that you didn't just come here to fight with me. What are you really after? Fine. Let me tell you an old story. Hashirama, do you know about the Divine Tree? Divine Tree? Long ago, before people even had any concept of chakra, and just kept fighting with each other over and over, but the Divine Tree never took part in the battles. It was merely worshipped by them as a sacred pillar. One day, the Divine Tree bore a fruit that only appeared once every thousand years. Tradition said that no one was ever supposed to touch it, but a princess decided to eat it in order to achieve victory on the battlefield. Her name was Kaguya Otsutsuki. She became the first person ever to possess Chakra. Kaguya gave birth to a child who also possessed Chakra in his body. His name was Hagoromo Otsutsuki. He taught people about Chakra and became the founder of Shinobi. He was also known as the Sage of the Six Paths. Do you need me to explain what happened afterwards to the person who took the forbidden fruit in order to stop the war? Ever since someone reached out their hand to take that fruit, humans have been cursed to hate each other even more than before. Would you not agree that Shinobi are the very symbol of that foolishness? In which case, would you not also agree that moving into a world that can be remade through Genjutsu is the best plan of action? Is... Is that the dream of the future you've been speaking of? Yes. It's just a little different. What do you mean? <laughs> I would be a fool to explain it all right here. There is one thing I can say. Obito will not be the one to complete it. I will. Why? Why did you end up like this? My own way of life. No one has any right to order me around. I might as well give it to you straight. That dream time we shared when we could discuss the future together is over. For now, let us just enjoy this moment. Yeah. 